As we all know, our country is going through some challenge, challenging times. The economic crisis has hit us hard and there's uncertainty in the air. But you know what? I strongly believe that difficult times bring out the best in us. Our society is built on unity, compassion and resilience and fed by the teachings of Lord Buddha and many other religious leaders that nourishes our soul. So it's crucial that amidst this adverse situation, we don't allow ourselves to fall into the hands of foreign forces who might exploit our vulnerabilities for their own interest. We need to rally together and remember that our true strength lies in our unity. I know it might seem tough and, and the road ahead might be challenging, but trust me, we can turn this crisis into an opportunity for growth and change. It starts very simply, like what our panel said, with each and every one of us embracing the power within ourselves to make a difference. How can we make a positive impact? Well, the question and the answer is very simple. It can be as simple as supporting local businesses, buying locally produced goods and investing in our communities. By doing this, we can boost our economy from within and reduce our dependency on external sources. Remember, we have faced difficult times in the past and emerged stronger than ever before. This is just another chapter in our story and I have no doubt that we will come out of it shining bright. Together, we can overcome any obstacle that comes our way. So let's stand tall together, shoulder to shoulder pro as proud Sri Lankans. Let's lend a helping hand to our brothers and sisters who are struggling. Let's show the world the unwavering spirit that runs through our veins, which we call being a Sri Lankan. From the deepest corners of my heart, I urge you all to stay motivated, stay positive, and stay united. Together we can create a brighter, prosperous future for Sri Lanka, for us and for our children.